Okay, guys, so I want to go over my seven-figure, literally seven-figure SEO strategy using just an iPhone and YouTube, okay? And here's proof, by the way, I use this exact strategy that I'm going to go over step-by-step step to grow these two businesses. The first one was a business, a marketplace that I grew from zero to over $300,000 in its very first 12 months, right? That's it right here. I, I recently sold this business. And uh, now, uh, a, from zero to $60,000 a month with my new B2B SaaS. This is the uh, a screenshot from Stripe from January this year. So, yeah. I'm gonna go over exactly what I did to grow both of these businesses. And I'd say 90% of the work was through this SEO strategy, right? And I'm using and leveraging YouTube search engine with SEO, right? Because when you think about SEO, right, SEO isn't just about Google, right? Google is mostly written SEO, as you know, right? But YouTube is the second biggest search engine in the world. And you can also be SEO'd. I want to go over actual tangible examples. I'm going to show you exactly what I did for did sorry for both of these businesses to show you exactly what I did so you can replicate it and do the same. Right? I'm going to reveal every single thing you need to know to do this. Right? Okay. So, and of course, this is called video SEO. So with Google, we have the search engine. Right? There's a search bar up top. You search for something and results appear. Right? Mostly written based results. You click one of these, you go to a written based result. Right? This is a search engine, Google. Right? Then you have YouTube which is what I'm talking about, right? But YouTube also has a search bar up top. You write something and it gives you a list of results in video form. These are all videos, right? All videos, okay? And so this is YouTube, video-based SEO. And then of course we have Amazon, we have eBay, we have Etsy, right? All these are also search engines, right? There's a search bar up top and they give you lists of products, okay? There's Pinterest for images. I mean, there's a bunch of different types of search engines, written-based, video-based, which is also, also, you can also include, sorry, TikTok here. Uh, Product-based, there's a bunch more. Image-based, there's a bunch more, right? But I want to focus solely on YouTube SEO. Because again, YouTube, remember, at the end of the day, it is a search engine. And we search for something, it gives you the video results. And because it is a search engine, you can optimize it. So there you go, search engine optimization. But you're optimizing for the search engine that is YouTube, okay? So, that other way, first step, of course, is to have something to sell, right? That's the whole goal. You're not going to be doing SEO or marketing in general because SEO is marketing strategy if you don't have anything to sell. So have something to sell. And I'm going to give you the example for this right here. So the thing that I had to sell was this marketplace. So this is, this is and was uh, an SEO marketplace where people can list uh, their services for sale. Wikipedia page creation, backlinks, whatever, right? Whatever it is, right? People can list their services here for sale. So... Again, in my case, I built a two-sided marketplace where people listed their services for sale. Now, then I need a way to market this. I need a way to get people to the marketplace to get them to buy the services, right? So here's what I did. I leveraged SEO, in specific YouTube, to record videos on how to do what people were selling on the listings. So as soon as someone would list a service here, I would record, and I'll show you an example, I will record a video on how to do this I'd rank, post it on YouTube, i would rank it number one on YouTube, and then i will have a call to action at the end saying, listen, yes, you can do this just like I explained to you, or you can just pay this guy to do it for you. And I'm gonna go over exactly what that was. So if I go here to my YouTube channel right here, YouTube Studio, and show you the video I'm talking about. Actually, if I just go here on YouTube and type in how to make a Wikipedia page, my video is gonna show up first, right? This is me, my face, one year ago. And this video till this day gets around 300 views per day, right? It's a video going over how to create a Wikipedia page. And of course, it's a call to action to the service on my uh, my website, okay? It links to that service from this guy to build a, a Wikipedia page, right? And in the video, I go over exactly how to do it. I don't blink, by the way, because I was reading off of a script, but I go over exactly how to do it, all the step-by-step -step process you need to take to create a Wikipedia page. And at the end, I do a call to action. Listen, if you want to do it yourself, you can, or you can just pay this guy to do it for you. Pretty simple. So again, what I did was I would, as soon as a service would be listed on, on my marketplace, I would record a video on it, right? I record long form tutorials and then at the end told them, like I said before, yes, you can do this yourself with what you learn or you can just go to hire this guy from my marketplace, okay? Like I said, then I'd rank the videos on YouTube and get a lot of views on them because they were evergreen videos that get views forever. And I'll go over exactly what the evergreen video concept is. And like I said, still to this day, this video gets around 300 views per day. If I go here and I just do analytics real quick here, you'll see that this video still gets a lot of views. And that's just one, right? There's a bunch more. If I go here and let's do the last seven days, right? It's getting 300 plus views per day, okay? So 300 plus people are searching on YouTube for how to make a Wikipedia page. I'm giving them a, a, a tutorial on how to do it and then with a call to action to this guy right here. And this guy still gets a ton of business because of that, right? It is insane, okay? 
Um, and so that's basically what I did for this business. Again, I would record and rank videos on YouTube. I'll, I'll go over later on our rank videos on YouTube. Don't worry about that. I just wanna give you an example uh, more. Now, the second example is for this one right here, right? My AI writer, it's called, not just just, just an AI writer, it's called tryjournalist.com, by the way. It's more than an AI writer. We write, we publish, we syndicate, uh, we, we create articles with links, internal links, external links, videos, images. Uh, we automatically post uh, to your site, right? We need to create all this. It's much more than just an AI writer. So I needed to find a way to promote this. What did I do? I'm gonna show you right here. I created, of course, a YouTube channel to promote and do SEO on the videos for. So if I go here to YouTube and just type in, uh, AI auto blogging. Oh, somewhere around here, my video will show. Uh, I don't, I'm not sure if it's for this keyword or not. Let me just go here. AI auto blog. Let me see here. I'm doing this live to show you. It should show up here. I'm not really sure what the keyword is. AI auto blogger SEO. It is. Let's go show up here the channel. Uh, 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 uh. Let's see here. This is a video of ours. This is a video of ours. If you just do best AI SEO writer. We show up as well first first here, and we should show up down here on our video, not this one. But yeah, so basically we show up, and I'll show you here, if I go to analytics, and uh, just go here to content, and let's just do, actually let's just do content here, let's just do views. Uh, we're able to create these evergreen videos that get views forever, for example, this one right here, right? It still to this day gets views, okay? Not many, but it gets some views. As you see here, it still gets views till this day. Again, five here, five there. Times that by the 400 plus videos we have on here, it gets an, a crazy amount of views. For example, AI blogging course, this one right here, not a good example. I wanna actually show you a good example of what I'm talking about. Uh, let's do this one right here, for example. Let's just do last seven days. Not this one, not a good example. I actually want to show you an example, and it's great that this is live because you, you actually see what the process is. Uh, 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 let's see here. Let's just do. Let's just go with this one. I think this is a good example. Uh -huh. Yeah, this gets views, right? Still gets views. It was posted. How, how long ago was this posted? Like it was posted in February, and it's still getting some views. Not a, not a lot, but some. And if I go here, and the reason why that is is because this is a, a YouTube channel that's quite new, but if I go here to this channel and type in autoblog, uh, which is a video we have here, this video right here, it gets views and it ranks for our keywords and it's been getting views forever, last seven days, right? 80 views, 90 views, so almost 100 views per day since it was posted like a year ago and it still gets views, right? I mean, it's a video that's essentially a four minute video going over and it ranks for autoblogging, autoblogger, automatic blog, which are some of the keywords we um, wanna rank for because our product does that. So the whole concept behind this is, and it's great that, that I've applied this to two different unique businesses. The, co the whole concept behind this is to produce videos teaching people how to do stuff, right? Because these are evergreen, right? If you produce a great, great piece of media telling them, listen, here's how you do X, Y, Z. If it is an actual valuable video and you're providing value, it will actually stick and rank and be there forever, getting views forever because it is an actual valuable piece of content. Well, that's something written on Google or a video on YouTube, right? That's how SEO works. Available pieces of content, media, writing, stay there because they're available. And the whole point of this is to produce these types of media, teach people how to do it, reveal every single thing and then say, listen, yes, you can do this manually or you can use my software or you can use my product. That's pretty much it. Now to rank YouTube videos is a whole video in and of itself. I actually do have a course on that coming in uh, the end of the month. Um, you can pre-order it down below. Uh, via, there's just gonna be a Stripe link, it's about $200. And I'll teach you exactly step-by-step step how to do it, how the ins and outs of, of how I've came up with this strategy and exactly what to do, how to record a video, what to say, what not to say, how to actually rank it. Link building for the video is very important. Um, On-page SEO, off-page SEO, on the video itself, because the whole, the whole concept of SEO on Google applies to YouTube just a little bit different. Right, and so if you wanna see exactly how I've done this and this, get the course. If not, I mean, there's a bunch of free stuff here on YouTube you can find out that way. It's just a way that you, if you buy the course to get it done uh, a bit faster. And by the way, I wanna show you another example. This one right here, right? This gets views forever. Still getting views forever. Now it's less, but it's again, times this by all the videos we have on the channel, 
we have basically built a multitude of different assets, video-based assets that all send traffic to our product, right? It is super, super powerful, and that's the power of this, right? Again, this video right here, there's a bunch more if I go here to content, and I just do sort by views real quick here. We have, for example, let's do this, local SEO course, right? A, a video, a course, and this still gets views. It was posted like years ago. It gets 100 plus views a day, right? 100 new people, new people watching the video, going over what I'm selling or what I'm not selling. Doesn't really matter. Of course, you have always have something to sell. But again, these videos rank. These videos work as assets. Again, there's more. For example, here's another example. There was a guy on here on this marketplace that sold um, the creation of Google Knowledge Panel. So I created a video on that, and then at the end, did the call to action. Again, this video gets 50 people per day watching. Again, these are 50 people searching for how to do it, watching the whole video or part of it on how to do it, and then most likely some of them will eventually go here and actually buy the service. Again, this is what I've done for both my business, for this one that I've just sold, and for this one that I'm building right now, which again, in January, we did over $60,000 in revenue. Again, that's it. You could literally take this and copy it. The, the whole concept is, okay, take your business, reveal every single thing about it, right? Do content on it. I mean, you can do written content on it. I prefer to do video content on it because YouTube SEO is much less competitive than Google SEO and it's great for more visual niches, okay? Do content about it, teach people how to do it, and at the end, do a call to action um, to, um, to people so people can go and buy your products. Now, in terms of YouTube SEO, uh, the same principles you apply to Google SEO work on YouTube. There's a couple more nuances. Again, I have a course on that down below in the description. You can pre-order it. Pre -order it. It's going to be released, released sorry, at the end of the year. So yeah, that's basically it. By the way, I also leave a link down below uh, for my free YouTube SEO course, which I do have one. Um, it's 100% free. But if you want a bit more in-depth on how to do things, grab the paid one. That's basically it. Thank you for watching. I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.